If you are an entrepreneur, work for a company or an individual that is considering to take their IELTS or TOEFL exam in the near future, I recommend that you watch this video. Why? Because in today's video, we are going to learn business collocations. So I highly recommend that you watch this video in its entirety and in the comments section, use one or all of the particular business collocations, write it as a sentence or a question. That is your choice. It's a great way to retain what you've just learned. And if you don't want to do that, again, that's your choice. However, use this video as study supplemental information. Use these particular business collocations. Make them part of your English journey. Live in English. Use them. When you use them, you will retain them. And as a result, it will improve your overall fluency and hopefully confidence as it relates to English. So, our first business collocation. Cover the running cost. As an example, the amount of money a company earns should cover its running costs. You might ask, what are running costs? Do you have examples? Employee salaries, utilities, rent, cover the running cost. Another, allocate budget to. Allocate, for those of you that don't know, think of assign or grant. For example, Every organization should allocate their budget efficiently. For if you don't, there might be a possibility that you, if you work for a company, you'll hear top management say, listen, you're having problems with your budget and they might have to make some decisions and possibly like lay off people, which you don't necessarily want to happen. So allocate budget to. What, you thought that I was just done with two examples of business collocations? I have a couple more for you. Total revenue, I like revenue, or produce generate revenue. For example, the total, total meaning sum, I like that. The total revenue of the company increases by 15% on an average annually. So total revenue. Another example, generate produce revenue, you might ask. Do I have an example? It is time, it is essential to generate produce more revenue to increase our market share. Because in business, that's really important. You want to increase your market share. Hopefully, if you do that, then you will increase your profit, right? And produce more revenue. Profit, revenue, which leads me to the last two business collocations. Make a profit, maximize profit. Please listen. Every organization enterprise, the major goal of a business is to make a profit, not money. There is a difference. Why do I say that? Somebody said to me one time, oh, what's the goal of a business to make money? And I'm like, really? Well, listen, if you made a million dollars, right? And then you had $2 million in expenses, did you make what happened? Did you make money? They're like, no, I lost money. I lo it, So remember, profit is different from money. So remember that. Another example after make a profit. I like this. After you make a profit, which is a good thing, I would encourage you to maximize your profit. And after you maximize your profit, what can you do? Reinvest in your company 
in terms of developing your employees, your people. People can make or break your business. So make a profit or maximize profit. These are just some examples of business collocations that I hope that you make part of your everyday life because it's important and business makes the world go round. Some people would argue that it, it doesn't, but my opinion is it does. So this is Teacher Will. Welcome to the place where hopefully you and I learn together. That's certainly my hope and definitely my prayer. Click on that subscribe button, hit that bell notification so that when I drop a video, you are made aware of it. Thank you very much for listening. I hope you learned something today. And more importantly, I hope to see you next time.